to talk about mergers and acquisitions today. Is that what you uh, decided that that's we should right. do? That's right. That's right. Okay, we got this um, five million dollar company. Uh, they they need cash. They're growing, and whenever they're growing, you know they need cash. That's right. Um, what do you recommend? Well, there's uh, different ways to look at it. Um, if they have uh, good cash flows, uh, you know, in terms of profitability, I should say, and uh, and they have some collateral to borrow, maybe they can uh, go out and get a bank loan. And that's kind of tough today. And, yeah. Banks are making some loans, but they are difficult to get today. Um, or another alternative would be to bring an investor in. Um, or a third alternative would be to possibly sell the business um, to somebody else and partner with them going forward. Um, you know, through uh, you know either an equity investment or where you sell the business outright. And uh, we're seeing that there's a lot of transactions going on. Are today. there? Are yeah. there really? Yeah. Do you recommend getting an investor? Uh, only if it makes sense. Um, getting an investor is like getting married. Um, <laughs> That's true. And we know that it's we probably know, probably easier. Right? And, and without, without without going into my social commentary, there is a pretty high divorce rate in this country. Yes. So. <laughs> yes. Is it higher in investors or is it lower? Um, it depends on if you do your homework. If you up do front. your homework, okay. Yeah, just like getting married for real. Okay. Do your homework up front.